this is another book haul for the month of May that I bought from Book Kharido and these are all the books that I got Family of the Speaker I was very excited for this one V. Schwab and this is okay let's check them out one by one Welcome to the Sinclair family. They were always liars. We will start this video with a short book which is Family of Liars by E. Lockhart. This is a murder mystery and it is the prequel to the number one New York Times bestsellers We Were Liars. It takes place in summer. The family is on an island on a vacation and all their secrets are going to be revealed and it is going to haunt them for days to come. This is a short story as you can see from the size of the book itself. Continuing with our streak of short novels that I bought this time, next I have the second and third installment of Before the Coffee Gets Cold by Toshikazu Kawaguchi. The second book is Tales from the Cafe and the third book is Before Your Memory Fades Away. It is a sci-fi book with separate short stories having a common thread in a small cafe in a back alley of Tokyo, Japan. You can go back in time and the only catch is that you need to come back before your coffee gets cold. I have the first book and I have read it. It was a little bit sad so I had avoided this book till now. There is one more book in the installment and that is Before We Say Goodbye and I think that is the only one left and apart from that I have uh, all the three books and this is Before the Coffee Gets Cold. This next book is guaranteed to make you cry. It is Color Purple by Alice Walker. I got this book specifically because it is a winner of the Pulitzer Prize. This follows the story of Celie, a young black in girl a country, born, born into poverty and segregation. Raped repeatedly by the man she calls father, she is separated from her two children, a beloved sister, and is trapped in an ugly marriage. But then, she meets the glamorous singer and magic maker, a woman who has taken charge of her own destiny, gradually her own spirit and reuniting her with those she loves. I don't know what to say about this book. I have another book by Holly Black of the same series, but I haven't read it, so I won't be able to say much about it other than that, that this is a fantasy drama book. This is from the Folk of the Air series. Uh, I had initially bought Queen of Nothing uh, from the series without knowing much about this book. Then I got Quill Prince, and now I finally have The Wicked King. And so my series is complete. The next book is Anxious People by Frederick Backman. I have another book by the same author, A Man Called Ove, and I read that book and I enjoyed that book. So I decided to give this one a try as well. It is available as a Netflix series now and I have decided to read the book before watching the series. So a bank robbery happens when a couple is apartment hunting. The robbers decide to hide in the same building as the couple and take everyone hostage. The neighbors come, the police come and there are some anxious people in the story and I am also very anxious to know what happens next. So going by the summary, I think it's going to be a funny read and it will put me in, in a good mood. I love books that come with map like this. This is The Lost Apothecary by Sarah Penner. This is the revenge mystery story, revenge in first half and mystery in the second. So Nella helps women to get rid of men who have wronged them and this happened in the 18th century. In the present day London, Carolyn finds of his husband infidelity and she comes across an apothecary and she comes to know about the apothecary's murders. The lives of Nella, Carolyn twist and mingles 
and not everyone survives the secret life of audi loru by v e schwab i had started this book as an audio book and i had got through five chapters and then i decided to get the physical copy this book follows a young french woman in 1714 who makes a bargain with the dark that makes her immortal but also curses her to be forgotten by everyone she meets i was trying to get my hands on this book for a very long time but it was out of my budget it was so costly uh, but not anymore and i'm very excited to start this one again The next book is on a philosophical side. It's Sophie's World by Joster Gardo. This is a 1991 novel by the Norwegian author. So this follows Sophie, a teenager who is introduced to the world of philosophy when she is asked the question, "Who are you?" So you can see that this is a fat book and this has almost 435 pages. According to the reviews that I have read online, This dwells on western philosophy and the book starts to pick up from 200 pages. Nonetheless, it's easy to say that this will not be an easy read. This next book is You and Me on Vacation by Emily Henry. This is the second last book of this month's book haul. Two best friends who are completely opposite to each other have been on 10 different summer trips and this is their last chance to fall in love this is the plot of this novel so needless to say that this is a romance novel this last book is also a romance novel ice breaker by hanna grace this book has been making quite a buzz on the book talk so i decided to give this a try You can easily guess the plot of the story by looking at the cover itself. Anastasia Allen has worked her entire life for a shot at Team USA, a competitive figure skater since she was 5 years old. Nathan Hawkins, the captain of Maple Hill Titans, knows the responsibility of keeping the hockey team on the ice. When a misunderstanding results in the two team sharing a rink and Anastasia's partner gets hurt in the aftermath Nate finds himself swapping his stick for tights and one scary coach for an even scarier one the pair finds themselves stuck together in more ways than one but it's fine because Anastasia doesn't even like hockey players this was the second part of the book haul for the month of may and we'll soon list all these books on our website so that you can rent them and read all your favorite books the website for book kharido will be given in our description so you can check them out as well and you can rent our book from our website www.thebluebooklibrary.com or you can also dm us on our instagram page uh, the blue book library that's it for this video if you liked it then uh, please like share and comment and uh, we'll see you next time thank you